Well, now that it's summer, like, there's way more things to do. Like, now you could actually go outside, like, get wet, go and sprinkle, do something. It's summertime, you don't have school. I go outside, and I go outside, and I go outside. I just want to get out of the house. Dear Highlights, now that it's summer, I have more time for fun. Can you help me find fun activities that I can do safely? There's not a lot of things to do because the virus has been going around so much. A lot of the things we usually do are not possible right now, or we have to do them differently. We were supposed to go to the beach, but then it got canceled. I'm going to camp, and there they, we have to wear masks when we're out of the rooms. There's going to be like two sides of the pool, one group and the other group. I missed the sea caves this year because of coronavirus and because I wanted to go on like the little hot tub day when it's moon, moon time. I really want to do that. I play baseball every year and I'm on a travel team that, um, we're not really that, we haven't practiced a lot, a lot of rust. It's just, you can't like congratulate your friend on a good hit or you can't can get congratulated or you're not allowed to go and spend time with your buddies in the dugout and laugh and chew gum with each other, hit seeds and all that fun stuff. But we are still finding ways to have fun. I uh, go outside. Mm. Gardening, yoga, and reading lots of books. All of quarantine I've read a lot. You know, I just finished a book that I really like. It's called The Fifth Wave. And uh, it's about like aliens or they don't know if it's aliens. Well, I finished the book, but I'm not trying to spoil anything for people. Um, I'm gonna play with the water balloons and go in the swimming pool. I go outside and I go outside and I go outside. I got the Ivy book upstairs because I was reading it earlier. But this is the other book I, I got. It, it's by Judy Bloom. It's called Tales of a Fourth Grade Nothing. Since I'm going to fourth grade, I decided to read it. Playing with my friends and running around the neighborhood and causing a little bit of trouble here and there, but not much. Well, I go outside, I swim, and um, I do stuff that I have outside. <laughs> and sometimes bird watching. Kids are also finding new ways to do things they used to do while staying safe. One thing I have to say is during Corona, Everybody's been getting pets. Like everybody. They're either, my friends have gotten like two dogs, random people are getting ducks, like me. <laughs> people are getting snakes and bunnies. And uh, so I feel like there's a lot of animal love going on. I think we're gonna be able to just hang out with our friends a little bit more, like with no masks. I'm planting some tomatoes and some cabbage. I just put random seeds all in the all in the thing. Yes, they are growing. Actually, all the plants are growing. This morning, um, there was like big leaves everywhere, almost the size of potato chips. And we can all look forward to a day when we can do our favorite things safely again. My birthday's coming. I was gonna have a Harry Potter themed birthday with chocolate frogs. Some people who haven't done it will do the Harry Potter test. Yep, I'm in Ravenclaw. I want to go get my friend and go out and get ice cream. I really miss ice cream. And I'm going to just get a bunch of friends and bring them in the pool. Because no one can go in the pool. It's either that or I'm just going to get all my friends and we're just going to go on a big bike ride. If you need help thinking of ways to have fun this summer, connect with your family and friends to ask for their ideas. And check out the Highlights Kids website and YouTube channel for more fun suggestions every summer. I just grab like some sand and I try to do my best to do a sand castle. Write highlights at letters at highlights.com to share your ideas for fun things to do this summer. You might see your ideas in another video. I made my own bitmoji in it. <laughs> the guy with the green hat, AirPods, a beard. Because I'm planning to get a beard when I grow up. <laughs> I have nothing to talk about. I ran out. It's sad. I usually always have something to talk about, but I just ran out for the day. Watch more videos like this one on Highlights Kids, the channel just for you.